So down at the scrapyard, we have a lot of people asking us, us how to make more money, right? So this is one of those secrets inside of the scrapyard on how to make money, but also sometimes how to save time. Here I have a basic water heater. So there's a bunch of things that I look at and I say to myself, what's worth it, what's not worth it? Now these water heaters have insulation in them. That insulation is directly behind this panel and that is gonna be about an inch to two inches thick going around the entire thing and to the bottom. That's what keeps the hot water that gets warmed up much warmer saving energy. But when I look at these units, I always say, how can I make more money? Cutting these cords all over, that's a real simple sign to be able to make more money. You chop them off, you can even pull some of them off through these quick connections. And some of them have circulating pumps. This is a small motor on the top. This is another thing that you can make more money on. You turn to the side here, you can see one, two, three, four screws that pop the unit off. You cut the cord, you get a piece of copper wire and a small electric motor. From there, just doing a quick look around, you have about a half a pound of brass sitting here, another half a pound sitting here. So between those two pieces, you might have three or four dollars. Now, my scrapyard generally buys these as whole units. We're not looking to make a lot of money on them. They're big, they're bulky, they take time to take apart. But if you're looking to make more money on water heaters, one thing you can do, they have diagrams on the side. Now, a lot of the newer water heaters are really just gonna be heated up by black pipe inside steel coils but some of them as I push this over some of them on the bottom this does not have it will have a round piece right here and that is going to be secured by four screws once you take those four screws out instead of using traditional steel coils that generally is a copper piece and many of you have seen it many times it has a circle on the bottom it's blue it's black you pull it out and there's about a 15 to 20 pound piece of copper and that's being used to heat up the water inside and when you drop that off at the scrapyard and you don't take that apart you'll instantly be making less money now a good thing to look for this is a, a white or a gray water heater the ones that have the copper coils are generally blue they're a little smaller and at the top they kind of have indentations think about a propane tank for your grill but much bigger that's kind of what it looks like when we get one in we'll make sure to save it and make another video of it those have 15 pound coils on them those you can really make money on but before you cash this in at the scrapyard for a few bucks make sure you spend some time pull off the brass the motor the wires my customers they'll generally save half a dozen of these do them in one shot or they'll do them right before they drop them off they can make a few extra bucks probably more money on the brass and the copper wire than the entire water heater as it is so let us know what you think there's another secret from the scrapyard scrap you later Thanks for checking out this scrap video. For more exclusive scrap video content, please become a YouTube member of our channel today. Thank you and I'll scrap you later.